but I want everyone to be honest. Were you born with that desire? Did you like, were you like six years old thinking, oh yeah, I can't wait to like go to different countries or did the travel industry put that desire onto you? Did the influencers who were doing all this, who looked so cool, did the, the, that whole business, did they put it onto you? Because for some guys, they would have loved exploring when they were super, super young. They would have loved it. Sure, maybe that works for you. But did, like, was it genuinely, like, is this a genuine, authentic desire inside of you? Or has it literally been so deeply rooted into you that once you make success, once you make some money, you go and travel? Because that's what I realized for Scott. I, I saw it to him, okay. You're the kind of guy, very much like me, you get onto a routine, you work super, super hard, you like the routine, you like working hard, and that's like all you care about. Very like masculine, routine oriented guys. I said, okay, why exactly would you go to Bali? Because you're not, like, correct me if, if I'm wrong, are you going for fun and pl for pleasure? Do you like having, like, you know, the fruit bowls and the cute pictures and stuff? He's like, no, nah, I don't give a fuck. I was like, I'm just going there for business. I was like, how would it be better going there for business when this is the best your business has ever been so far? Why would you change it? And this is when his jaw started to drop and literally I was breaking his fucking dreams. I was like, what if you didn't change anything? What if you were unchanged by success? Let's say, okay, you said once you make five or 10K a month, that's when you'll go. What if you didn't? Because what if you were able to scale from zero to 10K a month here in this environment that this was the right environment for you, but the desires have been placed into your mind that are convincing you to do something else? If right here, let's say for you guys, right, right here, when you live with your parents, this is where your routine is absolutely 10 out of 10. This is where you are like actually making some good moves in your physique and everything. Why would you move to change that so quickly? Is it because you might get some validation, even though you won't want to admit it? Is it because someone else has just moved there and their desires went into you? Is it because you've seen some travel YouTubers or, you know, there's a guy you like who's traveling and it seems kind of cool? Now, if it's a part of your purpose, like your core desire in your life to go to like, you know, see a new land, it could be. But is it your desire? Because I realized it's not for me. But it feels so weird for me to say that, but like, I don't like traveling. I don't give a fuck. But all of my life I've been told that that's what you do when you start making money. It seems weird for me to make this amount of money and I still live at home with parents. But this is where my routine is fantastic. Now let's say, okay, I'm done with traveling. I want to go move in with my girlfriend. We're going to get a house and stuff. That was my plan, right? And I literally just stopped. Imagine being months into this, this plan with your girl, thinking, okay, we're going to buy the house. We're going to go and, you know, we'll live with each other soon. And my girl literally believes this, right? And I do, I do as well. But literally looking at the house, it's going to be beautiful. And suddenly I have this realization when I'm saying this to Scott, thinking, wait, I've, I should probably take that advice. Why am I about to change the routine that's literally built me into the man that I am today? Now, sure, when like we're absolutely ready to have children and stuff, yeah, sure. But right now, why change it right now? And then I'm remembering the times that we kind of like lived together and the relationship was a lot harder because it brings, you know, it's a very complex situation when you live with someone else and you share like those intimate moments a hundred, five hundred times more than if you just see each other every now and then. And here I am growing to an incredible level. There she is at her place growing to an incredible level. Why are we changing? Why are we desiring something else? Because it's the normal thing to do, right? You get a year into a relationship, you buy the house, you get the mortgage, right? That's the normal thing to do. Who put that desire? Was that desire like formed into my heart when I was born to get a mortgage? Or did someone put that into me? But did a whole industry potentially brainwash us into that? And again, like some people are, are disagreeing in, in the comments. 100% bro. If your desire genuinely is, for example, house ownership or it's the travel, then if it's your desire, 100% do it. This isn't me trying to convince you, oh yeah, these things are bad. This is me trying to tell you, scrutinize the desires that you have. And if they're placed there by someone else, it's probably not the thing you should dedicate your life to. This is where these desires can come from. And this is why it's so important because if you get distracted with these random desires that pop into you from the, you know, the travel industry, because they want to sell you the, the plane ticket or, you know, the guy comes in and he's more muscular than you. This could be months of your life that you've just added a new layer, which wasn't supposed to be there. You know, the, 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 like the, per, the trajectory of our lives is literally just to like navigate through these layers to get to the core desire. Imagine adding these layers on yourself and it takes months away from your life. It takes years away from your life. Now, unfortunately, motherfuckers have done this already. 
because they made us go through a shit education system for 15 years. And maybe if you've got, you know, parents who are somewhat like bullies, they're, they're telling you, no, 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 this, this is the career for you. Every single time you open up the Instagram app, there's another one. Every single time. This is something for you to be extremely vigilant about.